take Porphyria. What's the matter? You ungrateful swine! Where did you go with your man yesterday? Huh? I thought we had an agreement that there will be no him from now on. If that continues, I'm gonna kill him. Do you hear me? Now go fix yourself. We need to go down and sell it. that your parents weren't able to join us tonight, Roger. Ah, yes sir. I'm sorry about that. They're still in Italy for a business trip. So, how is the wedding preparations going so far? We're working on it, Tanya. Very well. Orphea, do whatever Roger says. After all, we know that this marriage will benefit both of our companies and... Please excuse me. I'll just go to my room. But... Please. Mom, Dad, I'll just check on Porphyria. Please, allow me to check on her too. Go ahead. Porphyria, open the door! Mom, Dad, the door is locked. She won't open up. What's with this kid? Go get the keys! She's gone! Porphyria was her eldest daughter. Did she really know the culprit, John Doe? No. John Doe was my daughter's daughter. You and Porphyria were really close to each other, weren't you? Yes. Did he really stalk your daughter? Yes. He has been following my daughter despite her engagement with Roger. How are you related to the victim? She's my fiancé. We're about to get married in a couple of weeks. And that man who killed her? He's a stalker. She already mentioned that to me. Killed her. Killed my Porphyria. On the 23rd day of January, at 10 in the evening, where were you? Who were you with? What were you doing that night? Were you with Miss Porphyria Black that night?
periphery. I love her. Sir, sir, sir. Sit through that children. What did you feel her? Sir. 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 What did you say about her person, sir? Sir. 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 Based on the body's autopsy, the death must have occurred at about midnight because of asphyxia, cerebral anemia, and shock. Also, there were local marks of constriction ligature and abrasion in the skin. These evidences lead us into thinking that she must have died from strangulation. By the authority of the said state upon their oath, find and present, that one John Do, on the 23rd day of January, in the year of our Lord, 1924, with force and arms, in eleven in a country, with twenty thousand persons, and nineteen in all other countries, did unlawfully, feloniously, with malice aforethought, kill and slay one for Furia Blanc by strangulation. Therefore, the accused is found guilty. Aren't you supposed to be with your parents? Shh. Please. Let's get you inside. Okay. Tell me what happened. I can't do this, John. I just can't. What do you mean? I have a favor. And I need you to help me with this. You do know that this is forbidden, right? You should be with your parents. But I guess I'll help you with whatever I can. Then end my life. What? I want to die! No! There has to be another way. No, there isn't, John. I can't do this. I can't risk you dying in my arms. What choice do I have? I don't love him. I love you. Please, help me with this. Okay, I'll help you. She loved me. She, 
too weak for all her heart's endeavor to set its struggling passion free from pride and vainer ties to serve her and give herself to me forever. Porphyria worshipped me, surprised, made my heart swell, and still it grew when I debated no. what to do. That the moment she was mine, mine, fair, perfectly pure and good, I found a thing to do, and all her hair, in one long yellow string I would, three times her little throat around, and strangled her. No pain, thought she. I'm quite sure she felt no pain. And I, its love, am gained instead. Perfira's love.